The largest land of Mamru can be found in Maipo. We visit there and explore them today. Seven of the eight Hong Kong true mangrove species occur there. The green parts are the mangroves in Maipo. We were going to see the mangroves now. The tutor was teaching us the function of mangroves in Maipo. And we tried to answer the questions in UMPC after walking around the mangroves. After that, we took some photo of what we had observed. Why are the mangroves important? Mangroves are important to numerous animals such as fish, shrimps and crabs which feed on the fallen mangroves leaves. Mangroves are important in maintaining a natural ecological balance. We saw that the birds were catching the fishes near the wetland. It eats its food near the mangrove because there is a lot of food under the water so it just moves its mouth left and right to eat. The tutors were asking us to find out two types of mangroves which were commonly found in Maipo. The first type of mangrove we found was called a canthus. The picture below was the shape of its leaf. It was lucky that we could find it and took a photo. This was the fruit of a canthus. We cannot pick it and we can just see and take photo. The second type of mangrove we needed to find was called a Fisilia. This picture showed the shape of its leaf. This was the one we found in Maipo. This was the fruit of the Aphicelia. It looked like some pears. We also saw a lot of Cantelia. The picture above was its fruit. The fruit of this species were obovate in shape. It is very interesting. These were the leaf of Candelia. The roots of Candelia was called knee joints, which grow above the soil surface for gas exchange. Where do the mangroves grow? Mangroves grow on the wetland. How do mangroves grow? A fruit of a mangrove falls in the water and grows into another mangrove. The, the end. end.